The financial experience at big banks also comes with a lot of friction. Late fees, ATM fees, high interest rates on loans, account minimums to open, and fees if you want to close. And my personal favorite, non-sufficient funds fees. That's where you get charged money for uh, not having enough money. The reasons big banks have to do this are simple. They need to cover the costs of their big buildings, networks of ATM machines, and everything else that used to help them acquire customers in an offline world. This means a couple of things to us investors. Banks need people to deposit or borrow much more money than digital wallets to break even. The average big bank loses money on banking the average American. This is a totally different story for digital wallets, because their customer acquisition costs are so low due to them not having any networks of bank branches or physical ATM machines and so on.